All right, so in this video, I'm just gonna to talk to you about is working as an OT still worth it? The best part is I get to ride my bike to work. I worked in acute care, hospitals, hand therapy, skilled nursing facilities, and I just started working in ergonomics. Now I spent a lot of my time working in Las Vegas and it was great. It paid really well and for the most part it was really laid back. But now I live in California and while California is beautiful and has a beautiful ocean, there are definitely drawbacks. And one of those drawbacks is work life I would say is probably just a little more stressful and then everything here is just more expensive and I'm getting paid a lot less than I was in Las Vegas. I found that hand therapy just doesn't pay well enough. Home health documentation just takes too long. Skilled nursing facilities, you just don't see the patients progress enough to, for it to be rewarding. So I really felt that acute care is kind of the niche that I want to stay in. Now don't get me wrong, there are a lot of other good settings, like you can get a good job or a good paying job in hand therapy or acute rehab. But in general, I would say that hospitals just, just pay the best and have the best benefits. For occupational therapy, for me to continue doing this, I have to do something outside of working for someone. And that's to just start creating a business, to try to start working for myself. You have to just not become complacent and just start moving forward and doing something new. And for me, it's, it's trying to start a business, it's trying to start a website, a YouTube channel, and just trying to grow myself. And I definitely wanna grow myself in my field as well, um, at the hospital I work at, to continue uh, taking CEU courses and learning as much as I can in my field. But I also wanna start doing more OT coaching and creating courses and focusing on ergonomics. So is OT still worth it? I would definitely say yes, but I feel like for me at this stage, after 10 years, it's about trying something new, trying to start and build a business, doing courses. And yeah, I think that's, that's what it is for me right now. Now, if you're looking to grow yourself as an OT, I'd say check out my ergonomics course or sign up for my OT coaching page. And also check out my other video on the best OT settings to work in. And thanks for watching.